Welcome back to the Carver's Wood Shop. I'm at the William Rush Carving Show here in Media, Pennsylvania at the Penn State Brandywine Campus. We're in the auditorium. This is my setup. It keeps getting longer. <laughs> and I was able to put the new um, new DVDs up, uh, holders up there that you see. And then I have two of my turntables and a place where I can work. And the TV with uh, my recent ones I have with some of the carvings along with it. And like I said, a place to work. And then around the corner, I have another um, turning table with the with some of the DVDs and a couple of the um, ones I had finished online. So this is what it looks like. It's kind of lengthy, but uh, from the end of the gray all the way up and around, they gave me an extra six foot table. I'll be doing a demonstration at 2 p.m. and at 1, 2 p.m. today, Saturday, and another one at 1 o'clock tomorrow uh, afternoon. But um, it took a while to set up, but I'm, I'm very happy with how it turned out. Uh, I don't think I want too much more stuff, um, but I was here most of the day yesterday setting up and trying to figure out how to put this together. Kind of ran out of um, the cover, so I used a gray throw over the end, which seemed to work just fine. Uh, I was happy about that. So it looks like I'm ready to start selling today, and I hope uh, today goes well. Let's just take a look around uh, at the rest of the place here. Um, we have quite a few vendors here. And uh, just to walk around here and show you how big the place is. We have about 70 some vendors coming today. There are two um, carving supply vendors, one on that side and one on that side of the wall. We'll walk around here real quickly and uh, take a look at some of the stuff here. So you get a good idea of what we have and you know, if you decide to come out and take a look, uh, we'd be happy to have you here. You know, a lot of work put into putting this together. We have some wildlife things as well, as long as along with carvings and such. Let's walk down this way. They have the competition going right now, um, which they start for about an hour, and then they'll bring their pieces back to the table. I didn't enter anything. I don't normally. I don't, Feel like I don't have the time to really put a lot of effort into it between everything else that I do and uh, there's Bob Hershey's stuff many of you know who he is he's part of the Lancaster County Wood Carvers and uh, he's won many um, many ribbons and things in first place with his stuff, with his carvings. Um, some people like to do realistic fish, and that's realistic. Hello. So this is what it looks like. Beautiful birds. Just to show you a little peek of the what it looks like when they do a a competition type thing. This is the competition room, and they're going to start taking probably three to five people together, and they'll go to each category and pick out the best out of a numerous categories that they have. So I can't go in there right now. Last year I was a judge. That was a very interesting experience. Here is some of the books and things that you can get at the show. And she has all kinds of carving tools and things like that. Um, you know, a wide variety of paints, tools, 
small tools, carving tools, knives, some pre-cutouts that you can uh, rough outs. This is where I'll do my lecture later today. Uh, we'll see how that goes. I did last year, it was fine. Um, this one's, um, I'm trying, Fred Henderson. He does nothing but carousel horses. He's also from our wood, uh, Lancaster County Woodcarvers Club. Uh, Fred has done a great deal of work um, and he does an excellent job. Look at the giraffes, they are so cute. But he does an awesome job putting these uh, miniature carousel horses together. We have some boards that are painted and carved out. Very interesting. I don't think he was here last year, but it's very good. No. There's some <laughs> no, reindeer. Well, they tried it. Uh, and some natural looking stuff, uh, nature wise. It's uh, a tree there as an ornament holder. That's very clever. Very good. I tried that one time. It didn't work so well for me. Um, here are what some people really enjoy doing are these uh, houses out of bark. And uh, they're very, very interesting. So if you can get a chance to come down here to the show, come on down. There's lots to see and lots to, uh, you know, lots to observe. And you can ask these folks questions. Many of them will be more than happy to explain how they make things, uh, what kind of wood they're out of, how it's done, and anything else that you need. There's always somebody here that probably can answer it for you, uh, pertaining to wood carving. So I hope to see you here down at the uh, William Rush Show. It's November uh, 5th and 6th, and uh, we will be here today until 5 o'clock and tomorrow until 4 so if you can come down and join us, please do. Thank you very much. Take care. We'll have another video very shortly. Bye-bye.